Welcome! Today, I'm going to show you how one unified solution replaces multiple products to perform backups, recoveries, and migrations, a Cronus Backup and Recovery Advanced Platform. We support any virtualization platform you choose. This product is a revolutionary way for organizations to simplify disaster recovery and data protection. It is affordable. One application replaces multiple solutions and works seamlessly among physical and virtual platforms. Reliable, award-winning disk imaging technology works across physical, virtual, and cloud environments for both system and file recoveries. Fast, shrink backup windows and meet recovery time objectives. And its intuitive interface and agentless backup makes it simple and easy to use. I'll show you how easy it is to create a backup plan, recover a virtual machine, and handle migrations, all from one solution. First, we'll create a backup plan for several virtual machines in four simple steps. Step 1. Determine what to backup. I'll pick five virtual machines that are running agentlessly on a VMware host, and one physical machine to show you how easy it is to do both with a single user interface. Step 2. Choose where to backup. To any location, using disk, network shares, SAN, FTP, tape, or cloud. Step 3. How to backup. I'll choose Custom Backup. Here's where I also set backup type and copy data from high-speed disks to lower-cost media. These settings can be done with a few clicks. Specify a second location, check a box, choose another tier, and so on. Step 4. Under Plan Parameters, you can choose to have a complete disaster recovery plan automatically emailed to recipients when a system is backed up. This is what a step-by-step -step disaster recovery plan looks like. Even a novice can carry out a complete system recovery. Now that we've completed the backup plan, let me show you how easy it is to recover a machine in the event of a disaster using one solution. There are two ways to recover a machine. Follow the recovery plan or go to the data catalog and search for it. I'll use the catalog and search for the machine. Once found, highlight it and click Recover. Next, identify where to recover. I click on New Virtual Machine in the Where to Recover section, then click on Browse. Select the virtualization server where the new virtual machine will be created and click OK to complete the recovery. Press Start and it boots up. Using this simple process, you can recover in minutes, but if faster recoveries are needed, just create a virtual standby machine and restore instantly. Finally, I'll migrate to a virtual machine to show you the third part of our unified virtualization solution. Step 1. Create a backup plan for machines you want to convert and enable Convert to VM option. Specify a destination, click Run Now and Convert. Select the agent to create the new machine, choose the host, identify the location and click OK. Step 2. Choose Convert to Virtual Machine. The conversion is underway. When the machine is ready, it appears in the vCenter global tree. The same process applies in Hyper-V environments. Click Power On, and the new machine boots up. It's that easy. What you've seen here is only part of our unified backup, recovery, and migration solution for virtual environments. Acronis Backup and Recovery 11.5 Advanced Platform has many additional features. To learn more, go to our website and download a free trial version.